So here's an example of barricades or obstacles that we put on a gate to keep the peacocks and the chickens from even thinking about going over that fence. Now, I don't know why they don't want to fly over that, but the fact is, after having them for about over 12 years, I have found out that they don't want to fly over anything with obstacles like this. So we took this farm gate, which is just a typical farm gate, which we drive through if we have to, um, and we attached the pickets that I cut of standing rabbits. Now, if we hadn't done that, those birds would just jump up on this metal pole on top, sit on it, and hop over to the other side. But because these obstacles are here, they don't even think about doing that. So this is an entry gate, which has also got barricading standing rabbits on top of it. Um, the peacocks, the chickens, wouldn't think at all, even consider, perching on top of that or flying over it. I don't know why, that's just the way it is. The same could even be said of wire fencing. This wire fencing is only about four foot tall, but never once have my birds flown over it. Now, they could fly up in those trees any day they wanted. But for some reason, they fly in the trees, but they don't fly back into the driveway, over into the driveway. You see, birds like this will jump on something to perch on it and then hop on over to the other side. They just don't fly over it. Now, they better not prove me wrong after my saying that, but I've had them for 12 years and I've just never had any problems with it. Here's other picket fencing picket fencing that the animals never fly over. And some of it's pretty short. I know you've seen this fencing many times because I have this fencing all over the place. So I've got it there. And I've got it over here. And my birds just walk around. Now they will perch on that fence, but this is not a garden that I have to keep them out of. So I mean they'll perch on this gate. They'll go ahead and perch on that gate. They don't fly over the gate, though. They'll perch on the gate and then hop over to the other side. And I don't mind them being in this garden because they don't, they don't really eat anything in this garden except for insects. But, once again, in answer to the question, won't your birds just fly over that little potager fence? The answer is, no, I don't think they will. They just have not done anything like that in the past. And hopefully they don't, <laughs> are going to start now. Oh well.